So you just say, hello, how are you? And then just go into it. That's what I'm going to do. Hello, how are you? I'm with Ryan. Ryan Watson, who is the man that uh, helped me make Two Housemates. He's my fellow co-director and Ace. <laughs> bring it. I'm also a wrestler. Oh, yes, that's <laughs> you're oh, doing. Yeah, that's it. Oh, you're that's founding yourself. Yeah, I thought you were like, going, come on. I know, I'm a bring it. We'll fight. Oh, you're a lobster. I'm a lobster. Okay. Um, yeah, he um he, he also uh, edits it really well, and um, I mean, there's loads of things you contribute. He is one of the, the the main reason why the show is there, really, because otherwise, without him, the show wouldn't exist. It'd just be in script form. So um, he cameraman, DOP as well. Um, he lots of Damn right. we, we do lots of jobs here, um, and uh, well, it's all, we job share, don't we? We job share quite a lot. People are surprised with how little people are involved mm. in making the show. Because you always see behind the scenes stuff of like, oh, um, you know, here's, here's Rodriguez yeah. and 900 other people. <laughs> um, with us, it's literally, I mean, here's, here's, here's two people who share about 10 job titles. Mm -hmm. um, and then there's about three or four other people that are involved in making the show. Yeah. And then that's it. Yeah. It's like you see, you know, lots of, lots of monitors everywhere and lots of cables and we're just mm. a tripod in them, really. A camera in a room. We, are, we <laughs> have double A batteries on set. Yeah, we do. Absolutely. Yeah. Um, and why why aren't they on more sets? That's exactly. The They're one. very useful. Um, in like interviews that I've I've had about two housemates, I've I've talked about how much series two has changed and mm -hmm. uh, from series one and what's different about it. But obviously, you know, those are my words. How how mm -hmm. does um how does it feel for you as somebody who's you know worked on series yeah, one. Yeah, well I'd I'd say the I'd say the same really. I think it's it's um it is a bit um more I'd say sedate. I think there's there's um more of a more of uh you know, characters are, are put in a direction and they go that way rather than you know, um Things series one happen, yeah. yeah, series one was sort of episodic in which sort of you know they were, a, a they visit were or something or, yeah, you know, a story within the episode. We've got a fairly we've got a long thread running through most of it so mm. yeah you know oh uh, th this is this has always made me wonder how you felt um how did you feel about being the co-director and did you get annoyed at all that you weren't the director <laughs> not really not no because really. it was kind of because i sort of have more an idea about cameras and you as i say you knew what the script was mm. so it it fitted. It fit. Fitted. Fit. Fitted. Yeah. Fitted. Fitted. Yeah. Fitted. Yeah. Um, in this in this scenario, you were okay with it. Yeah, it it worked well because, you know, I didn't have to I didn't have to sort of sort of validate any ideas apart from it, it kind of worked well, um, this time round because you directed the actors, uh, sort of plainly and because you know the script and you know what it, what's going on with the characters and I sort of directed for camera so mm. you know shots and lighting and all the rest of it so yeah it worked pretty well you know I, I enjoyed working with you as like a co-director's thing as well because um, yeah, you know we understood you. <laughs> it, we understood we mm. understood um, where each of us are I, I, sometimes I would get concerned that um, you know there was there was a point when you know like uh, yeah, I I get concerned because the last thing I want you to feel mm. is if it's toes treading and yeah, you're it, yeah. yeah, and that you feel sl slightly pointless as well at times, which because you're definitely not because you're you know you're, <laughs> I mean you're you're you know, you're literally like the, the yeah. past me you're the second most valuable person there oh, by far yes. by far yes. so it's. You know, I, I mean, I, I put me first because obviously well, I'm, I'm, I'm in it and I'm writing. Yeah. Thing. Anyway, but like you are, the, if, if I'm not there, then you're the most important person there by far. Uh, yeah. Because, you know, you're not only you're in control of camera and what uh, is yeah. being seen. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You're also, you know, you're, in, you're second in command. Oh. You're second in command by far. I have, I have my thoughts. <laughs> <laughs> I can't stop killing. I have, um, yeah, that's trouble. <laughs> but yeah, you're, you're, the, and I hate for you to feel, oh, why, why am I even here? Because no. you're incredibly valuable. Well, it's to me. It's... <laughs> <laughs> uh, uh, no, it is a sign, I think, of working professionally. If you can, if you can learn to adapt, and mm. this time it worked well. And yeah. as I keep, as I kept saying, you know, it's just it, because you knew the script and you knew the character's line, or the character state line, 
whatever. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Line of play. Mm. Um, and you had an overall view of the of the story of it. Yeah, no, it worked well. It worked fine, and I mm. I didn't sort of feel... The only thing I, I might have wanted to do was... Um, was speak to the actors just a little bit more, but but not sort of as in speaking to them about their character or you know chat away. Mm. Uh, or you know, I'd like to get to know them and get to know how they work and all the rest of it. Yeah. Um. But uh, it's just there. It's just the 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 whole. Um. It is just the the whole um business of of having to do it yourself thinking you have to do it yourself yeah, thinking you yeah. have to shoot it and duck and edit it and all the rest of it um, but I see further out I think you'd probably want to edit after you know any any work other um, after this you know you'd probably want to have that in hand and all the rest of it so um, I, I, th- I, th- I think it, if, if we were to talk uh, about what we do in the future mm. I w- what I would prefer mm. is that we had a place to meet to edit it together yeah yeah because yeah. Like I know, I know my my shortcomings. Mm. Um, I have one leg longer than the other. It's a I'm, real pain. It's a real pain, and thank you for being the fireman. Um, <laughs> but um, I I, I know for a fact that you are so much better than me at editing. Uh, so right. much better. I mean, because you know, I I put that Christmas sketch together, right? And that took me ages. <laughs> when you could have probably had it done in a day that took me three days and it looked nowhere near as shiny as the things that you make because you know how to do color grading you you know what you're doing so the thing is if if in the future i would prefer if we had a like place to meet for you to just edit it in front of me and for because that would just be streamlined if i just go yeah if we could just focus on that a little bit focus on that and Mm -hmm. stuff like that because as much as i can give notes Mm -hmm. i don't think i'd be capable into like doing the things that i give you yeah because then i'd be like the, I mean, I, I am, I like, I am nowhere near the level you, you keep, you, you call but the, this, me. But, the, you, but, you're only saying that because you're English. But no, no, <laughs> I'm not. I'm, I'm saying that I... Take the prize! <laughs> I, I just learned by doing it. And mm. all those, and it sounds corny, all those mistakes along your, along the history and form what you are. And um, I don't think, you know, if, if you wanted to edit something or um you know you've got the skills to edit a a short film now you've got that and and so you know all you need to do is keep keep doing that or Mm. keep um or edit something else and edit something else i mean mine mine is my stuff is sort of it's nowhere near the level i mean if you're talking about broadcast there are there are certain compliances you've got to think about there are there are ways that of cutting there are ways there are um you know, um, tests for things like epilepsy and things like that that yeah. you know, I but that, we'd probably comply with. But yeah, you know, I'm, I'm but that that sort of thing, that sort of thing, we're is, unsure of. We're not sure of at, at the level you're at, without even having to go into television and stuff like mm. that, and without having to, you know, like be compared. Mm. You are very good. <laughs> you are very, very good. It's only because it's only because I played with Microsoft Office at, at four years old and, exactly. <laughs> and then just so ramped you, under yeah. there. It's, you know, <laughs> that's, that's all it was. Yeah, it's not going. It's probably us. It's not it, going out. I, <laughs> I just, I just think you know when you just yeah. see someone who has so much ability and can do so much stuff. It, it's very hard for me not to say you're a very talented well, man. Well, thank you, thank you. you but, I'm more than welcome. But um, no, give me your money. <laughs> <laughs> but no, you're incredibly talented. Man. I think it's. But you can. But you can do it. I Thank mean, you. I appreciate that this as is well. The thing. You 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 can do it, and you can work to it. Mm. Two housemates was an exercise in trying to, to trying to improve my own skills, and well, that's mm. why I did it. And so, series one is. Um, series one will be ragtag compared to what series two is now, mm. and the future work will be rag will be um, not, not se- yeah, series not, two not will be that story. ragtag. Yeah, and, you know in future. So it's ju- yeah, it's just it's just, it's just a- elevation as you build of up and capabilities. And yeah. you do it, I do it. It's you know, mm. it's, a, it's we're just as as it's kept. Re- oh, I can't even form words today. <laughs> as keeps being repeated through. The interviews that we've done and all the rest of it, we are incredibly lucky to have tools and all the rest mm. of it that are at our disposal to do it. And you know, I've just, I just, 
coalesced on the video side of things and, and you know when I acted or when I acted as a child I used to sort of take a in Bernard's uh, watch <laughs> you know you looked at what they did and although being an actor you although as an actor you're kept away from a lot of that you're kept away from yeah. a lot of the back behind the scenes you know you're whooshed between places and, and all the rest of it you know you look around and you sort of look through the window and look what other people are doing and mm. sort of it's more an exercise in emulation rather than actually getting the job done yeah. in a, in the way that they do it but this is the thing though because you know like one of the reasons why I produce in the way I produce is because I saw people you know I was on set for a very long time on a certain show and I didn't like how it was run. Mm. I didn't like how people were spoken to. I didn't like any of that sort of stuff. Mm. I thought, this is counterproductive. People are coming back absolutely miserable. What's the point of that? Yeah. And with two housemates, I, that's what I wanted to install. I wanted to make sure people were as miserable as that's possible. It. No, I wanted to make sure that people were, you know, minimum, yeah. enjoyed the experience. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And um, That's, that's yeah. the thing. I mean, as... as as soon as you start to get money involved and all the rest, of, that's that's the time. It, do, it does start, muddy it. But, people yeah. start getting a bit um, sharp and, and mm. a bit wary of, of time and all the rest of it. And yeah. so that's that the advantage can, we have, admittedly. That also can, yeah, so that's it. I mean, we we are we basically <laughs> spending our own money. Yeah, yeah. Um, so, so it's it's not as essential mm. as if you've got an investor or a financier barking in your ear and saying, "Well, mm. why isn't this here?" You know, you've heard, I've heard stories of script pages being ripped out because they don't have enough time and they just say, well, mm. fuck it, we'll put it. This was, <coughs> yeah, it's what happened with um, Sherlock. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So I had, like, another scene, two scenes. And really? Yeah, they just yeah. Cut it. They had to cut it. They had no time. Jeez. So, yeah, that happens. But, um, so, yeah, I, we're, we're kind of lucky, but the best thing we can do if we ever get to that level is try and retain some of this, what, you know, some of, yeah. this, some of the feeling of what we've done before. Joy. Just yeah, it's just retain the feeling of joy just, and sort of, you know, re respect for yeah. other, other workers. People ask me this and whether I'll keep this in, I'm not 100% sure yet. Mm -hmm. Would you like to do another series? <sighs> oh, I or think it's like going to gonna be on? a while. <laughs> yeah. Um, I would only do it if you have a story to write mm -hmm. and have reason for, to write that story. Yeah. Um, and if you think that some other sort of form will suit it better, will suit you, the story that you want to tell better, mm. then fine. I'm happy. Um, I'd love to work with the people that I work with here. They're all nice and kind. Mm -hmm. um, so, yeah, only if you have, only if there's lineage on the old beast, I think there's, mm. yeah. That's your decision. <laughs> That's your yeah choice. I think you were talking mm. about like doing a spin-off, but yeah, as I say, I think if the story's there, go ahead. But mm. okay, yeah. Well, that's there. You go. Yeah, that's you can rewatch so, this after the after the series ends. So and I'm just apportioning all blame. I'm apportioning all the pressure to him. I'll Bye. take it. I'll take all of that. My limo. <laughs> yeah, I'm still I'm still deciding. Yeah, so, I'm yeah. still deciding. Well, um, thank you very much, Ryan, for coming on the channel, and um, you know it's obviously a huge pleasure to speak to you anyway, and it's nice to have a, like a proper chat with you. Yeah, we, we hardly ever do that, really. Oh, yeah, put it over there. Yeah, okay, then put it over there. Okay. Oh, we do talk, but not. Yeah, yeah. But um, yeah, no, it's lovely to speak to you, and um, all of Ryan's details are available in the description. Um, and Ryan also has a YouTube channel that he sometimes um does stuff on. I have a busy little YouTube channel with little blogs that I occasionally update and just little bits of I call them sandboxes which is just loads of clips that I've gone out together like and subscribe definitely give this guy um, as much love as possible um, he does a fantastic job on the series I'm, I'm incredibly grateful that he is around um, so obviously he deserves a thanks for um, making two housemates possible as well so um, <laughs> so yeah thank you very much thank you very much for watching and um, thank you thank you for giving me this this little platform which is more than welcome totally unsubstantiated really but fine yeah lovely <laughs> <laughs> about the interviews yeah that's fine <laughs> see you later Bye -bye.